That's the viewing platform for the mine, the pit. I'm standing at what's left of the Iron Blow copper mine, Queenstown, Tasmania. This mine here is on the Great Lyle Fault Line. And this fault line is rich in sulphur, iron, copper, silver and gold. I think that's a little hamlet of Linda down yonder. This iron blow mine was the first mine site on the Mount Lyle field, which has 22 known ore bodies. The mine was discovered by three prospectors, a couple of brothers, Bill and Mick McDonough, and a Scandinavian seaman fellow named Steve Carlson. They found a gold mine. In 1892, the mine was sold to a new company of shareholders who were looking for other minerals. This company of shareholders, the Mount Lyle Mining Co, bought a copper mine. The Iron Blow copper ore body was disappointing and phased out in 1922, but the Mount Lyle Company went on to buy other leases, making its investors very rich. The yellow rocks around the edge of the pit had a low schist. They were formed on this fault line about 500 million years ago. The road to Queenstown heads down that valley in the middle of the screen on the horizon. When I arrived here, you couldn't see this pit. It was covered in clouds. It's a shame there's so much cloud around because there's some beautiful mountains here too. The Iron Blow Copper Mine, Queenstown, Tasmania.